honestly think they need to slow down, take a breather, let's regroup. Let, let the packs breathe. Give people a chance to enjoy these packs before you start releasing the next one. All these corporations, y'all need to relax. Like he said, the world ain't ending tomorrow, even though <laughs> there's a lot going on in the world right now. Hey everyone, it's Brie. Welcome back to my channel. I'm back with another video. And we're going to be reacting to High School Year's Who Kids Cast Kit Already Teased. Sims team. It's, <laughs> actually, no one knows. Not the Sims team. It's, it's a Maxis. Um, EA. Um, what, what are you doing? <laughs> what what are we actually doing here? Um, we, we, literally, we literally just got High School Year's like a day ago. Um, and it's, it's literally broken in shambles it's like literally not even like it's barely playable at this point um granted i know they had a like a little roadmap um of them showcasing what they had planned coming up it it appears that the sims team is being put on a very condensed timeline now it like it, it honestly seems like um you know ea is pushing the sims team to get packs out on a more often and consistent basis which i don't think that's a good idea i honestly think they need to slow down take a breather let's regroup let's look at some of these other packs that need fixing that need refreshes like i don't know i don't like this fast i mean i would like it if the packs work <laughs> like i wouldn't mind i wouldn't mind content coming out more quicker or quicker um if the packs were actually fully fledged out and working properly but the problem is is that with every single pack that comes out the game just gets more and more and more broken and so this is not the time this is not the time to be worried about no um no kit right now which by the way i'm low-key sick of these kits too granted the last couple of kits have been um have been good I just actually bought my first kit because I, I was one of those people that was like, I'm not going to buy a single kit because I was boycotting. I'm like, this is stupid. I don't like this. I want stuff packs back. But <laughs> they did entice me with that that kids one. I don't even remember what it was called, but it was the one with the, with the um, it looked like a little like outdoor uh sleepover situation. It had like the, um the uh the movie screen projector that you put outside and then they had like you know the little camping um bed and stuff like that i did buy that one because that one did look really cute but <laughs> they, they need to stop it they need to stop it they need to slow down and and, and chill out <laughs> but um but let's see and this video is by um iron seagull as far as i'm aware he don't have no uh no drama in the sims community and plus i like his content anyway i tend to go to him for for my sims news and so yeah we're gonna see what I, iron seagull has to say all right so high school years just came out today and yep. the game has some very critical bugs so much so that the main menu even acknowledges that and SimGuru Nick has acknowledged one of the other bugs as well, and Sims are randomly becoming famous. But oh yeah, I heard about that one. Toss that aside because the next kit is already being teased. Yep, yeah, that's right. I wish I was joking, but I literally took a nap and woke <laughs> up to see this news. Please, EA, stop this ride stop, for five bro. minutes so I can get off and take a breather. Right. Holy moly. <laughs> But yeah, Sims community found this image on the Where? main menu. And uh, what's funny is that it's promoting the release of high school years, yet obviously They're children. it's not that pack that's being used in the image because that's kids. It's not elementary school years. We're probably a couple years away Wait from Wait a that. minute. What this image is very, very likely to be teasing is the style kit that's supposed to be coming out mm. sometime this quarter. They did say that we'll be able to start trend setting early. 
To me, that strongly suggested that we were going to get a creative sim kit that is aimed at a younger age group than teenagers. I guess. And I figured it would be about toddlers because we got that little campers kit just recently, yeah. which is also for kids. It's for build mode, but still, <laughs> I figured, okay, I mean, we don't get kids content that often, so it makes sense to me that they would have switched it up and made this one about toddlers, but no, we're just getting another kids kit already which i mean is cool but i guess it's way too soon way too soon ea and maxis literally just released their biggest pack of the year unless there ends up being a second expansion pack i doubt in it the fall but i doubt it they don't even let this one breathe for 24 hours that's what i'm saying let let the packs breathe like we just got werewolves and then they shortly after that announced this one. And I honestly feel like high school years overtook the hype for, for werewolves. Because honestly, guy, who is thinking about werewolves right now? Like, I'm sure there are some people that still have um, their stories and stuff going on with their werewolves. But that's not the main focus. Like, I feel like, I feel like high school years definitely overshadowed werewolves. And I honestly think they should have let it breathe a little bit. First before they start teasing the next thing because i'm sure this was intentional it screams distraction tactic to me especially with the really disturbing bugs going on right now in the game and with high school years not being as well received now that the initial beginning of the hype is out of the way. Yeah. Hopefully now more of you understand why I was really not keen on moving on from werewolves so quickly. That was such good times and they're already over. But speaking more on this image itself, yeah, I guess the clothes look nice. It's kind of hard to tell because this is just like a drawn thing rather than seeing how it actually looks in the game. Right. But you know, this could be interesting. I mean, it did say trend setting early in that hint, so it makes sense to me this is going to be like some kind of modern children's clothing sort of deal. Mm. So this could actually end up being a decent kit, as decent as kits can end up being anyway. Yeah. But yeah, Little Campers was interesting, so hopefully this has the same Little kind campers. of fun energy That's what it's to called. it. I just hope that they don't already announce this kit next week because I hope not they're either. already having this image appear in the main menu so soon. Like at the very, very least, release a hotfix for this week's patch before Please. announcing your next product. Please. The world is not ending tomorrow, and EA, you're clearly not going out of business anytime soon. Right. So it's okay, you can take a little bit of a breather here. And that wraps up another Sims Info and Thoughts video. So man like let it breathe bro <laughs> like ea chill out like all these corporations y'all need to relax like you said the world ain't ending tomorrow even though <laughs> there's a lot going on in the world right now but it is okay like i get it like the world has become way more impatient people want their content um way quicker than before but They'll be fine. They'll be fine. People are going to whine. People are going to complain. People are going to, people are going to, people are going to complain. People are going to find something to complain about. You can't please everybody. Take your time. Make sure these packs work and give people a chance to enjoy these packs before you start releasing the next one. Now, granted, it's just like a little teaser image. Cause yeah, I, those are not, those were not teenagers that uh little monkey bar thing teenagers literally cannot use that in the game so th that had to have been children um but yeah it's just i really hope i really hope that they just they just pu push it back push it back to <laughs> just push it back um and just please focus on getting high school years fixed and the base game fixed and yeah i man i just and i don't know maybe they need to like hire on more people or you know expand the team like I, I and again I don't know how they do things I don't know how many people work for um EA and work on the sims team I don't know what their organizational structure looks like but ideally I would like for there to be a team to work on new stuff and a team to work on old stuff there needs to be a dedicated set of people on the sims team 
that works on the old stuff that works on refreshing the packs um cross pack um compatibility like we we need we need that to be worked on i would rather them um flesh out the older packs more and bring in more of that cross pack um compatibility than for them to keep cranking out all these packs like just 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 chill out <laughs> just chill out listen to the people the people are telling you to slow down okay like it, it's okay like it, it's it's fine you're not you're not gonna lose I, I i just i don't i don't think they're going to lose out on that many people if they just took a little breather and just focused on things that they need to focus on like please 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 just just slow down it's okay to slow down but um yeah but let me know what you guys thought are in the comments down below and if you guys are looking forward to this potentially uh next kit for the sims if you guys enjoyed this video make sure you guys give it a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys in the next video